Hi everybody, <laughs> I'm so excited. Today is the day. All right, <clears throat> okay, <laughs> I'm just excited. Okay, it took a long time for these books to come in, but I finally got the book, the final book covers. Um, they're done, they're ready. Um, some of you might have already noticed that they have already changed on the uh, Amazon, but anyway, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I want to do before I reveal is, um, I want to kind of give a history a little bit. So the first book that I ever wrote was Never Forsaken. And that was published way back in 2009. And it was through a vanity press. But uh, after a few years, I, ch I decided to go on my own. So I requested to get it back from them. And thankfully, oh, thankfully, they gave me back my files. It was in the contract that we could just... Um, sever contact. They would give me all my files back. I would still have the rights to the book. And um, so that's what I did. And I republished it on Amazon. So the very, I want to show you, I still have a copy. This is the very first cover of Never Forsaken. And while I kind of liked it, it was not exactly what I wanted. Um, they gave me three options to choose from and no one, none other. And so they said, pick from these three. And so this was the one that I came, that I decided looked the most like what I wanted it to be. Um, obviously, <laughs> when I moved to Amazon, I changed it. So the first cover, Never Forsaken, was this. Then after that, it moved to this, which is what it's been for a while. And I will show you what the new one is in a moment. And so to keep it in the same line, um, I did the other covers similar with a focus on one character and the same font and things. And so these are the three that are older, um, that are no longer there. I don't have the redeemed one because um, I gave that one to my son, <laughs> the old one. All right. <clears throat> so... Yeah. Um, yeah. So that was exciting. I um, so after moving to Amazon, then I wrote the next book in the series, Never Forsaken, um, Never Forgotten, and uh, about it took me about ten years to write the next one, and then within the next, I'd say it took me two or three years to write the next two, which was Never Forfeited, and redeemed and so i have a total of four books here um redeemed is the companion novel for never forsaken it's about uh one of the characters in never forsaken that i thought needed a better um ending and so um yeah i just i don't know i was looking at the covers and i was like i really like them i like these covers but they're just not what I wanted it to be. And so this is the back, the front, it's kind of dark. And I recently learned how to do full covers. And so that just excited me beyond. And then I found some graphics that really, really excited me. So this is not gonna be a very long video just because um, how long can I draw it out? I'm The next time I do a cover reveal, I'm gonna try and do a live cover reveal. Um, but that'll have to be set up um, at a certain time and stuff. But so I wanted to get these out because I want to concentrate on getting my next book out. And um, yeah. All right. <laughs> Enough talking. Are you ready to see the new covers? Oh my gosh, you guys. I love the way these covers turned out. All right. So the first book we have Never Forsaken. Oh my gosh, look at, isn't that amazing? I I almost cried when I opened up the book, the, the package and got these. Ah, amazing. And so, yeah, so that's the front. Now here, see, I changed the back as well. And the, the cover, the spine, and the back. Isn't that amazing? I love it. So I made it look like a journal page and um, I've also changed the back for each one, the description. So let me put my glasses on because I can't see anything. 
So for this is this story is about Maddie. Dear diary, I just wanted to be popular, to have friends, be part of the crowd, you know? And it was fun for a while, but now my life is a mess. I'm so stupid. I can't believe this is happening to me. I'm all alone and it's my fault. Mom's gonna kill me. No one loves me, not even God. I don't care what Taylor tells me. There's no way I'll ever be forgiven. Not now, not after what I did. I hate my life. So this is Maddie's story and she kind of began it all. <laughs> so um, I love this cover. Isn't this amazing? So uh, yeah, I just, I want to keep looking at it. <laughs> okay. The second one is Never Forsaken, which takes up with um, Lizzie. And so here's the second cover. You'll notice that they are similar. I, I did that on purpose so that when you go into um, Amazon and you see them, you will easily recognize that they are from the same series. So this is Lizzie. Again, I changed the back, the spine, and I also changed the back. I'm so excited, you guys. This I, this is just amazing. Okay, her. I also changed her back information as well. It says, "Dear diary, I always get I get what I want, <clears throat> but this time I think I bit off more than I can chew. My life's falling apart, and there's not a single thing I can do to stop it. And Maddie, well, let's just say there's no one closer than a friend of me. Oh, she makes me so mad. I thought I was unforgettable, but now." No one notices me, no one cares, not even my so-called boyfriend. I'm in trouble, big trouble, and I can't tell anyone because no one really cares. My life sucks, diary. What's the point? Woo, how's that? Okay, so this, like I said, this is Lizzie's story. Um, never forgotten. It says, I always get what I want. What do you think? Oh my gosh, drop me a comment. Okay. And then we have the third book in the trilogy, which is Never Forfeited. And I will hold the old covers up compared to the new covers. Um, Never Forfeited is about Taylor. Um, there you go. <laughs> and uh, you'll notice it's the same school background, just a different character. And his says, I thought this, I thought the past would, s oh, I have to read. I thought the past would stay buried. So that's about Taylor. So on his, also, the, the spine is different and the back. Again, it's like a journal. And so for each character, I included different photos that would represent their life. Um, so this one, if you'll notice, it has a couple scratched out. So it says, Dear Diary, with a line across it, Hey Journal, with scribbles, and then it says God. I thought the past would stay buried, but it hasn't. Why? I've tried to be a good person. I don't do those things anymore, so why are you allowing me to struggle with this again? I'm worried about the girls. Lizzie seems lost, and Maddie, well, only you can help her now. What am I supposed to do, God? I trust you. I really do. I don't think I should have to forfeit my future, but sometimes a guy has to do what a guy has to do. My only hope is that you won't leave me when this is all over. Yeah, so that's about Taylor. All right, I hope you can see this light is good. This was the best light I could find. So that's Taylor. So that that is the trilogy. I have one more Redeem. Now Redeem, the front cover didn't really need a whole lot of changes. Um, it's pretty much similar. I don't have one to show you because like I said, I gave my other copy to my my son, Alex. Um, but I enlarged the name. I added this, a companion novel to Never Forsaken so that people would know that it belongs with that series. And so it's pretty much the same cover, the same spine, except I did change the back. Okay, woohoo, look, <laughs> I added characters because I wanted to keep it in the same vein. Um, now these are just the covers. I'll show you what's inside as well. Okay. So, uh, these are the characters, Philip and, uh, Charity. 
Now the, the back information stayed the same, but I'll go ahead and read it for those of you who don't know. Um, Philip is a man in control, popular with his students, well-liked by his colleagues. He's got the world by its tail until he makes one decision that changes everything. Life spiraling out of control, he has no other choice but to return home. Thinking his life is over, he's on the verge of calling it quits, but then an unforeseen reunion makes him wonder if he can't regain what he lost. Now Charity likes her life. Friends, family, church, a job that she loves. What more could she ask for? Her life is simple and quiet, but after years of struggling to pull her life together, she's thankful that God has her back. Or does he? Philip's back in town, and she knows deep in her heart that her life is about to get messy. Two people separated by years, suddenly drawn together by circumstances out of their control. Can Charity trust God with her future when her past shows up unexpectedly? Will Philip realize that changing his future means facing his past? Will their lives be redeemed? All right, <laughs> that's what it is. Okay, so like I said, this is the back front. Now, here's the fun part. This is something, this actually was, um, the inside was actually inspired by um, Brittany Wang, author Brittany Wang, um, with her new book series that she did on Wings of Ash and Dust. Dust, I saw how she did the inside of it, and I thought, oh my gosh, I love that idea. And so I kind of did it, and I've seen it before in other um, books, but I wasn't sure if I liked it or not, but I, I really do. So I'm not going to show you everything. Well, why not? Okay. So, <laughs> um, so I've included a front cover with the characters and then for little chapter headers, I added a little icon for each chapter and it's the same icon. So, um, but it's a little, it's a little chickadee. See that? Isn't that cute? And I also um, did some reformatting. So th the inside of the books haven't changed. It's still the same story. I just reformatted them. So they all look exactly the same. So they're not, um, there was just some formatting issues in the other one that I didn't care for. So that's redeemed. Um, here is Never Forfeited, the old and the new. <laughs> I'm so excited. And, um, Again, I put a little person in there, and then um, if you if you ever, um, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be creating some name pl uh, autograph plates so that you can stick them in there. Um, I'll let you know when those are available. And then for that, I did a little car icon. See that? Yeah. So every chapter starts with a car icon. That's so much fun. And then here's, um, <clears throat> Never Forgotten, the old and the new. I'm really enjoying this new cover, you guys. I love it. And again, um, I put the same picture in there and her icon is kind of like a little star. And so, yeah. And then Never Forsaken, of course, the one that started it all, old and new. And again, she's in there. I just think it adds so much character to the book, doesn't it? Oh, I just love it. And then for her icon, I did a little heart. Okay, so those are the ones. Now, the exciting thing is, um, not only can you get these in paperback, but you can also get the same exact uh, books in Kindle, Kindle. There are, there is a, a couple extra pictures, um, images in the Kindle version that I can't show you because I don't have a Kindle of it. Um, but it's the same exact story. I've, I've updated the files for Kindle as well. And um, they contain the icons and the pictures and everything and the new formatting. So that's all good to go. So you can get every single one of these books you can get as a Kindle. All right. This has gone on a little longer than I thought. Okay, so here's the big news, the big exciting news. Um, originally, I was gonna do a giveaway of hard, cap, hard copy books, but that's just not gonna be possible right now. So what I am gonna do 
is I'm giving away to one lucky person a copy, a Kindle copy of every single book. So that means you get four books for free by simply following these instructions. All right, are you ready? Here we go. You'll need to head over to my website. Uh, I'll put it on the screen, www.kathywarub.com. And on that front page, there's going to be a contact form. So in the subject line, you have to put book contest. That's all. Book contest. And then on the, and then I need your name and uh, an email for, for me to be able to send this. Um. So write your email in the, in the body and your name. And then what I'm going to do is this is going to be open for a week. So uh, starting tonight, today until next uh, Wednesday. We're going to do it today to Wednesday, next Wednesday. So today is the 7th. Um, I didn't even think about that. So, so seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Anyway, till next Wednesday, I'll put them the details down below. Um, you can only enter once. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my, uh, comments or my contact on my website, and I'm going to write down your name, put it in a jar or a bowl. And then next Thursday night, I am going to pick the winner. And so I will announce the winner next Thursday night um, of who's winning all four of the Never Forsaken Trilogy and its companion novel, Redeemed. Ah, I've never done this before. I'm so excited. Um, yeah, <laughs> oh my gosh. And so, uh, yeah. I think that that about covers it. I hope you really like these books. Please drop me a line, drop me a comment, let me know what you think. Um, I really, I really, really hope you like these new covers. I think they're just the fantastic. I did get feedback from a couple people before I posted them, before I changed them, and they were just ecstatic about them. So anyhow, good luck in the contest, and I will see you next week. Bye.